I miss. You know, that's we have a meeting last night. We're having a whole bunch of them. People can come and give their ideas. Do you, do you still support that? You talked that in the past. I didn't know yes. supporting what that I do in the past. I don't think I ever said that we should eliminate the uh, public advocate or anything. I said I think people should look at it. It's something that uh, your newspaper and many others have written about, and I think it's something that the Charter Revision Commission should consider. But, uh, you know, we have a good public advocate. Now I'm going to he's coming with me to the baseball game later on. Um, and it's up to the Charter Revision Commission. And I'm not here to tell them what to do. I tried to appoint an independent panel that will look at these things, and then they can only make recommendations. Then it's up to the public. So it's not up to me, and it's not even up to the panel. It's up to the public, and that's just one of the things that people want to look at. I have said repeatedly, I think, that a lot of people talk about eliminating the borough presidents. I, for one, have come to believe that the borough presidents really do provide value added. I don't agree with everything everyone does, but on balance, the borough presidents provide at a local level, working with community boards and working with the city council people, a valuable service. And whether you can do it more effectively or not, whether they should be allowed to do A, B, or C, those are the details. Uh, yes, sir. Mr. Mayor, there's a